Hello and welcome back to Memory Sports TV and then this video is released. We are just seven hours ahead of the second slam tournament of the year 2022. This tournament starts on September the 10th, link is in the description. And in this video I would like to give you a short introduction of all our 16 competitors in 160 seconds roundabout. So with no further ado, let's go. In seat number 16 we have Evelina Press from Poland. In the past she was into competitive dancing and now this is her second qualification for the slam. Good luck Evelina! In seat number 15 the first time for the young Polish competitor as well. In a slam tournament he is a medicine student Maximilian Kozlovic from Poland. Good luck for your first seat number and in seat number 14 the man from Egypt to try to qualify for the slam a couple of times. Now it worked out. Mohamed Ramadan memory coach and memory organizer from Egypt. In position number 13 world ranking 23 a legend in memory sports. He won the traditional world memory championship three times and now he's back with his second qualification for the slam. Ben Pridmore from England. Seat number 12, Canada's hope, Don Michael Wickers. The second qualification for the man who is so good in memorizing words and pushes his own training scores almost on a daily basis. In seat number 11, our first German competitor in this tournament, Kevin Schulz. He is into memory sports already since 2008 and now his second slam qualification. Good luck! And seat number 10, our first woman in the field, we have Zayaka Hokasono from Japan. And she is one of four competitors from Japan in this slam. S seat 9, the rising star from Italy, trained by world champion Andrea Muzzi and now also his third slam qualification. Let's see if he can get to the second round. Good luck, Emanuele! In seat number 8 we have Orkan Ibadov from Azerbaijan. He has already reached the quarterfinal in the Pan American Open. So look out for Orkan in this slam. In seat 7, second Japanese competitor here, Yasuhira, third slam qualification and has, he has to play his fellow Japanese competitor in the first round, Sayaka Hukasono. Looking forward to that match. In seat number 6 he qualified for all four previous slams and he was in the quarterfinal in all these slams. Can he reach the semi-final this time? The man from India Vishwa Racha Kumar. In seat 5 the top Polish competitor Jan Zon, semi-finalist in the Asian Oceanian Open last year and three times quarterfinalist. Let's see what he is capable of this year. And we are entering the top 4. Rio. Kobayashi, nicknamed Koba, went all the way through to the final in the last year's Pan American Open. Let's see what he can do this year. And the top seed a Japanese player Naoki Miwa, he has improved a lot and he is a hot candidate to go to a semi-final or maybe more. And in second seat we have a legend here also of memory sports. She is a real monster in a positive way when it comes to memorizing international names or words. World record holder Katie Kermode, second seat. Uh, and the top seat in this tournament, Simon Reinhardt from Germany. He has won the last slam in July and he is of course the hot favorite also for this slam. And there is something else to grab for him. If he wins this slam, he would surpass Andrea Muzzi in the world ranking and become number two in the world ranking behind Alex Mullen. Let's see if he can do it. So this is it. Don't miss the Asian Oceanian Open live on Twitch, Memory Sports TV. See you soon and keep on memorizing.